Alright, so this video we're going to look at evaluating a function from, the gra from a graph. Alright, so first off, this function that we see here, okay, we're just going to call this function f of x, okay, and that's the function f of x. And we want to find f of 0, f of negative 1, f of 1, and f of 3. Alright, so you know that this is the x-axis. This is our y-axis. And <clears throat> here's the, there's the x-axis, there's the y-axis, and then each block here is one unit. Okay, each block is one unit on the x-axis and each block is one unit on the y-axis. Alright, so looking at this, let's look at this. We want to find f of 0. So you can see x is in parentheses. So when x is 0, we want to know what's y. Alright, so on the x-axis we go to where x is 0, which is right here. Okay, and then we have to move either up or down, straight up or straight down until we hit the graph. And in this case, since we're right here at zero, well, we're going to have to move up. You see this? We're going to move up. And we hit the graph right here at y equals 1, 2. So f of zero is equal to 2. All right, let's do f of negative 1. Let me erase this. f of negative 1. So x is negative 1. So on the x-axis, we go to where x is negative 1, which is right here. And here, we have to move down to hit the graph. And you can see we hit the graph right here. All right. So we go over to where x is negative 1, and we have to move down to get to the graph. And we get to the graph here at negative 1, negative 2, when y is negative 2. Okay, so let's look at another one. f of 1. Okay, so we start here at 0, 0, and we move on the x-axis until when until we get to where x is 1. So x is 1 right here. Now we have to move up or down until we hit the graph. Well, we don't need to move anywhere do we? See, we're already we're already hitting the graph. The graph crosses the x-axis at 1. So what would this y value be? Well, we didn't move up or down, did we? So the y value is 0. So f of 1 is 0. Now let's do f of 3. So let's come here. We're going to start where x is 0, and we're going to move to where x is 3. 1, 2, 3. x is 3 right here. And to hit the graph, we have to move up. And you can see we move up until we hit the graph. And that's at a y value of what? 1, 2. So f of 3 is 2. So that's how you evaluate a function when you're given a graph. All right, so I hope this video helped. Uh, give me a like and subscribe and check out my other videos. Thanks for watching.